to today's video this is a video that i never thought was actually going to come if you could see by the title of it this is my last week ever in college not exactly i guess i count it kind of differently but this is my last week of classes the week after this is finals we have a lot going on so thank you guys so much for joining me in this very hectic part of the semester nonetheless i'm so excited for you to be here if you're new hi my name is melanie i'm currently a senior at pepperdine and i'm gonna be bringing you guys around i would say a regular old week in my life but it's not regular for obvious reasons but let's head into this week hey guys i am chilling in my car as i always do before class because i get here way too early i'm just running through a little presentation because we're starting this week off strong and i have a presentation of my first class i'm gonna show you guys because i put a little bit of effort into it i don't know what i'm saying i always put a lot of effort into stuff so my presentation is on netflix for my quantitative analysis class so it's about like math basically but it's netflix theme look ah! i feel like my whole thing is it's not fun and it's for school at least make it a little bit fun for yourself i'm just gonna run through this a little bit and then i only have the one class today i'm gonna grab coffee with a friend afterwards which i always look forward to both the friend time and the coffee i like for some reason haven't been able to handle a bunch of coffee i used to regularly drink like two to three coffees in a day so i'm drinking a peppermint tea with lots of cream and honey but at the same time it's like making me more sleepy i'm gonna keep running over this and then i will catch you guys after class Okay guys, it's time for a little update. Got some Alfreds. This is one of the top things I am definitely gonna miss about California. Did a quick study sesh at the library. I'm definitely planning on doing some more studying today because every time I study, I realize how much I don't know. It's actually quite humbling. Honestly, I have like not that many classes this week. And although it's my last official week of classes, a lot of my classes are actually canceled. So I have two less classes this week, which is actually like six extra hours of free time, which is amazing. So I basically have like one class a day this week which means i have a lot of extra time for studying just running a couple errands on the way home because as i started to say i haven't been great about packing my lunch so i'm super hungry the first errand i had though was such a fun one i just picked up my package from bagu i love bagu and it was like the only place i shopped for black friday gonna go make a return and then i'll catch you guys at home hey guys so i'm clearly back at home i made myself some, I guess it's lunch. I don't know. It's like 3 p.m. But I made myself some food. I'm gonna get back into studying. I was planning on going to like a library because sometimes I like to get out of the house. I feel like it makes me a lot more productive. But the library is closed. I didn't know libraries were closed on Mondays. I thought that was like a Sunday thing. No big deal. I will just have to do work here, which is not a problem. But I wanted to do a little unboxing. Okay, not an unboxing, but I am itching to open this. A lot of these are gifts first off this one is a gift to myself i feel like it is so me it's like actually embroidered that's insane i couldn't even tell in the picture if it was actually embroidered but baggy tote bags are just such amazing quality like it has the zipper on top nice big pocket inside next off i got one for myself and then i got one for one of my friends just like the cross body these last things i mentioned already but the little like usable bags that fold up very cute you can call me lame but this is what I do to motivate myself to work harder. I am scrolling on Pinterest looking for my craft inspo. I love stress crocheting. Like, after going through my study guide, all I want to do is think about nothing and crochet. Um, so I'm trying to decide between 
this little vest or this cardigan. I know it kind of sucks when you ask questions on YouTube videos because obviously like I can't take your input. I'm trying to think. Obviously the crocheted like cardigan will take a lot longer to make. But either way, I'm just making granny squares. So maybe I should just start making granny squares. This doesn't really help because there's a bunch of different colors of yarn. But that purple, the pink, and like the green. Those four on top. Or what I'm working with. I've been a little bit lazy, but I'm gonna make myself get up and start studying. This is why I needed to go to the library. Hey guys, so I finished all of my schoolwork now at the prime time of 10 35 p.m so i think i'm just gonna unwind and crochet a little bit this is the pattern i'm going with and i think it's really cute and i'm super excited for however this is eventually gonna turn out but i'll catch you guys tomorrow Good morning guys and happy Tuesday. I can't believe it's like 76 degrees here in December, but this is the outfit I picked for today. Today, as I said yesterday, I only have one class again, which is super nice, but I do have to meet up with my group to work on a project. In order to graduate early, I did have to like cram in a lot of my classes towards the end and that was completely on me because I did not plan my schedule super well. But that being said, with this week, I have a lot of like wrapping up projects and stuff. So as I mentioned, I did one presentation yesterday. The other one is I have like a kind a big presentation for one of my capstones and that's on friday that one i'm a little bit nervous about you know how certain presentations kind of just like get you more than others and it's weird because like yes i've taken a presentation class like a public speaking class and i swear in that one maybe because that's like all we were doing i swear i was better there i think i've like decreased in my public speaking abilities which is unfortunate but I feel like by Friday, I'm just gonna feel so much better. Funny as it is, I speak in front of a camera a lot, but I very much not a fan of speaking in front of classes. So I can't wait to get that off my chest. But all of the other classes this week are pretty light because all the professors know that we are just preparing for finals. I have been so nervous for all of my finals. I'm not sure if you guys are super interested in this. I feel like I used to do these, this type of video more. Uh, maybe a little earlier on but I kind of want to do some like wrap up college advice style videos I think it'd be really cool to reflect. I mean, I'm that kind of person. I journal after like big things happen, you know, like graduating college Anyways, I woke up a little bit earlier before my class started. I kind of wake up like just to go to class <laughs> But I've been trying to wake up a little earlier to get stuff done I have to go talk to the leasing office since I am officially moving out in like two weeks So i'm gonna finish getting ready go talk to the leasing office and then I will catch you guys before I head off to my one and only class for the day Hey guys, so I haven't been super great about updating, but I got done with my class like quite a while ago. It's like 4.40 now, but I've just been at the library trying to get some work done, but it looks like there's gonna be a pretty sunset. It's been a little bit of a stressful day, so I just feel really behind on my finals and stuff, and I'm like freaking myself out. I might need to take a break soon. Hey guys, so it's a lot later now. I'm back at home. I was having this little conversation to myself thinking like, what is the best way to study? I feel like I should know this by the time I'm a senior and it's kind of hard because I think I know what's best, but it's really hard to do it and like put it into action. Let me explain. I am someone who wants to split things kind of evenly. Like I wanna feel like I'm spending like even amounts of time onto my different subjects. So it feels like I'm putting in my best effort into each subject. And of course there's some like exceptions to this. Like if there's some class that's super easy or it's a GE and I simply like 
don't care about it as much like sure i won't put as much time or i'll start studying for it later but i'm at this point where i have like three bigger tests and then I have other three classes are more like dialogue presentation, like not actual finals. I know they're weighted different amounts and I know slightly more for certain subjects, but I'm still trying so hard to study really hard for all three of them. And I'm like, Melanie, when am I gonna realize I need to really focus on economics right now because I'm bad at it. As I say that, I'm literally not studying for that right now. Anyways, it's like almost 11 p.m. and I don't know, no matter what, I like to have a little wind down time at night. I wanna show you a couple more granny squares, but honestly, I've been sleeping by like midnight recently, which has actually been really impressive for me because I used to be like a 2 a.m. girl. I'm gonna do a little bit more studying. That's like my update every time. I'm, like, I'm gonna study more, but yeah, I'm gonna study more. And then I'm gonna eat dessert because I do that every night too. That'll be my treat. And happy Wednesday. We are halfway through the week. Honestly, this week has been pretty chill, I guess, for the in-between parts because most of my big stuff, like my presentation on Monday was nice because I just got it over with. The other one on Friday, I know I'm gonna get more nervous once it gets closer. Wednesdays, I'm on campus from until like 9 p.m. It's like the first first like online no what am i saying it's the first like evening class i've taken my six to nine would not recommend i think i'm having a hard time processing that like for my wednesday classes since they're only once a week this is like the last time i will be with this class i'm gonna finish getting ready today since i'm on campus so long i like to like pack my lunch and my little snacks and stuff so i'm gonna do all that i'll see you guys when i am back at school Hey guys, I just got out of my first class for the day and I always have this big gap where I just basically go to the library every week or Alfred, but I'm just chilling because it's nice out and I'm gonna eat my packed lunch on this bench. Getting out, I won't even focus because it's so dark out. Going to class when it's this dark out feels so wrong. I know I'm being dramatic with the jacket, but I was too stubborn to go to the car and get my jacket all day. And I was freezing. Anyways, I am driving to my next class. I have seven minutes. But hopefully I get out a little early. It feels so much later than it actually is because the sunset's so dang early, but at least I got to see a really beautiful sunset when I was studying. I swear, like sitting in those cubicles is so helpful because I'm like zoned in. Like I can't believe three hours can go by so fast studying. Anyways, gonna go to class and I'll catch you guys after. I look so tired, I am, but I put like, not lash serum, I put castor oil on my eyelashes at night and I swear it looks like I cry every night, but it's just the oil. Anyways, it's almost one now. Honestly, all I did, I had class, I came home, I did more homework, I ate ice cream and now I'm going to sleep. It's just such a life. I do wanna show you guys this though. I am being the most extra person ever, but I'm doing this like entrepreneurship project. We have to do like a pitch to the class, like we're on Shark Tank. Long story short, we're doing like this straw thing and I'm trying to figure out how to make like a model for it because I feel like I always take it a step further with the creative stuff because I think it's actually fun to do, except this is not fun anymore because I don't know how to model stuff. And like, it was cool in the beginning and now it's getting too complex. This is my straw. Like, it's kind of cool, right? Does it look like a straw to you? Guys, this is the first foggy day we've had in a while, but I am about to head to my one class for the day. This is my last quantitative analysis class of the entire, I guess my entire life.
curry, which is just such a quick and easy meal. And of course I made it with noodles because I am such a noodle girl. Not, not like pasta, but like any form of Asian noodle. Guys, I'm not gonna lie, when I was at the library, I was getting so frustrated because I was really hungry and I was trying to like reteach myself stuff, study for my econ exam and my mind was like not working and it's like you have to decide that point when you're like i'm not retaining anything anymore i'm not learning i'm not working at full efficiency i'm too like tired or hungry and i need a break but sometimes a little worker bee in me is just like i just need to keep grinding like i'm already here and then being off campus i mean i study decently at home but I love me a good library session. I think my library time is very valuable. And so I was just really trying to figure some stuff out for myself and it just wasn't working. And I, I figured out that is because I am hungry. So here I am at home eating, stress cleaned a little bit. And then we're gonna go back to the studying. The thing is, after you eat a good cozy meal, I just wanna take a nap or watch TV. What's crazy though is a week from today, I will be done with all my finals. And sometimes I have to remind myself that I'm keeps moving on even if there's something I don't want to do. Like there's a presentation I don't want to do tomorrow, but time moves on. Eventually it'll be over. And in the big scheme of things, I probably won't even remember this little presentation that I'm dreading so much. Anyways, I'm going to keep eating. Probably going to watch a little YouTube video or something as my break. And then we're going to get back to the studying. I feel like this video is just redundant, but honestly, that's, that's just my life, so. Hello guys, and good morning. The big presentation and the end of the week, it's finally Friday. And all I can say is, I cannot wait for this to be over. I have to dress up too. Catch up with you guys in a bit. I'm running a little bit late. Today's not the day to be running late. <sighs> okay guys, I just made it to school and I just, I get so antsy. I want this presentation to be done. Hopefully, fingers crossed it goes well. This is my last presentation of the semester and of my entire college experience, I believe. Like big presentation. So hopefully it goes okay, but I'll catch you guys up after I finish. We are finished with our presentation and I'm so relieved that's that. It's like two hours of listening to presentations, which it's just been a very presentation heavy week, but guys, I feel so much better with that off my chest and now all I have to do is study for all my finals, but I think I'm gonna go home and take a fat nap. I'm so tired. I'm definitely taking a nap, but the first thing I do when I get home is of course, change into some comfy clothes or pajamas and I'm currently heating up food because I'm a hungry girl. My little gift to myself is a little break from studying because I'm so tired. I'm just gonna like rest for a while. I have some dinner plans, but other than that, I need a nap. Guys, I'm really excited for my little after school snack. You can't really see it, but it's microwave kimbap. You know how like the Trader Joe's one was out of sale for so long? They actually sell so many different types at like H Mart and Asian grocery store. So this one's like a red pepper spicy one i will say i don't know if you can tell but like it's literally falling apart i know it said you can pan fry it instead i ate one already that's really yummy i could never be like um a, a food mukbang youtuber because i just eat so unpleasantly and it's so good and i like taste so fresh even though it's frozen food i demolished that that was so good that was like actually a perfect snack the achiever in me is very excited to do something this is simply just very rewarding for me. Even more so than that, I feel like I show you guys this every time. This is what we've been through this semester. And all we have left are these exams to go through. That's crazy. It 
now Saturday. I completely forgot to end off this video. I ended up staying at school really late to study last night and I was so tired. I knocked out when I came home. So I just wanted to end off this video and thank you guys for joining me for my last week of college classes ever. I think it still hasn't really processed because I'm so stressed about the exams, but wow. I'm never taking another college class again. That's crazy. I just wanted to thank you guys so much for joining me for this week. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.